Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell has offered a compromise to keep money flowing for Homeland Security, but it's unclear whether the rest of his party will support it. Here's the problem. Congress needs to approve a budget for Homeland Security by Friday before the money runs out. The current proposal would also repeal President Obama's executive order on immigration. And some lawmakers are refusing to vote on the issues combined. McConnell's solution is for the Senate to vote first on funding for Homeland Security, then hold a separate vote on immigration. But some Republicans, like Tennessee's Marsha Blackburn, say you cannot separate the issues. We want it to continue to hold the Blackburn language, which would freeze and stop the president's executive amnesty. So rather than filibustering and forcing a government shutdown, we think the Senate Democrats should allow the bill to come to the floor for debate. The Department of Homeland Security is scheduled to begin furloughing its non-essential workers if Congress doesn't extend its $40 billion budget by Friday.